Wait, what? Oh no. Rap Fire TV. <laughs> now we all know Boosie and Lil Wayne are two of the biggest names out of Louisiana. Sure, there's Kevin Gates, NBA Youngboy, and others. But Boosie and Wayne took it to another level. But who's the king of Louisiana? Fans are going back and forth online. But there's a thin line between the rap industry and the streets of Louisiana. This man's an executive out of Louisiana. He calls himself Boosie's brother. ETCO. CEO of ETCO, everything check out. You know, I'm from Louisiana, you know, I represent my state. So we talking about Louisiana artists. This is my, this my personal opinion, but this is what I believe in. I wouldn't give a damn when nobody tell me, Boosie the king of Louisiana. And that's my little brother. I'm not just saying this because he my friend for over 25 years. Or I'm at his house, I go to his house, we, we brothers. and we, No, Boosie the king of Louisiana, dog, straight up. My little brother the king. I wouldn't give a damn. Period. And uh Lil Wayne, Lil Wayne, the greatest rapper ever to come out of Louisiana. Wayne, nigga. Straight up. Wayne, hands down. The most talented NBA young boy. The most talented come out of this bitch. Talented. Straight up, man. Hey, I'm gonna call a car to car. You know what I mean? Everything check out. That's just my opinion. <laughs> I'm the CEO of ETCO, nigga. I ain't lying. I ain't tell. I ain't tell no lie in this shit. Damn. So what do y'all think about this? Is Boosie the king of Louisiana? We all know that Boosie's name is ringing bells in every household name around America, damn near. Similar to that of Snoop Dogg in his earlier career. Wayne, not so much. And Wayne doesn't have much as a presence online, on social media either. Either way, neither one of these guys was allegedly invited to 50 Cent's huge Shreveport, Louisiana event called Human and Harmony. He invited some of the biggest stars from around the world. As we know, 50 Cent is investing in Shreveport and bringing new jobs to the city. What better way to celebrate than humor and harmony? But Louisiana native Hurricane Chris says 50 Cent is definitely out of line. Chris, this come down here and die, not show no love to Louisiana. This ain't book no Louisiana artist. This ain't book Big Papa. This ain't book Be Will. This ain't book Hurricane. This didn't even go to Baton Rouge and get no no boosies or nothing, no weddings. Like, didn't f with us. Came to take advantage of us. I don't 50 Cent took to social media, quickly responded, saying, Hurricane Flex. Boy, yo, sh what? The f you think you Fred Obey? You get no play in my ride. <laughs> in other words, who's listening to Hey Bay Bay in the ride? Damn, 50 gets disrespectful. Then Fred Obey chimed in. Hey. He ain't book no Louisiana artists, Louisiana legends. Who the fuck I am then? Yeah. You ain't think we was good enough for you to spend none of the money? What the God damn. The city good enough for you to come do everything you're doing? You can't spend no, you can't spend no money with none of my God damn, God damn, homie. Damn, man. God damn it. Don't look like shit, man. Way in. Let me know what you think. You know. You said the community was just gonna come support you, but you didn't feel the need to put the community on this shit. Yeah, this with your right hand man talk. Hey, you said, oh, they just gonna come. What? Ain't worth the check. Uh, so you just you looking at what you could gain off city wise? I see what it is. Then you got jokes about the shit, bitch. Then I don't know what part of you just fake ass rap real. Like I guess you. Some fake ass rapper and all that shit. This shit just like the boom docs. Like you can't believe in these fake ass rap. Supposed to be a solid. Ask your right hand man how the got the street put. Ask him how he got the street put. Matter of fact, listen to it out of somebody else's mouth. Besides sitting around, hear both sides of the story. Ask your right hand man how he got the street put. Tomless. I took, I spent thirty thousand dollars out of my budget so that somewhere to stay. My family stayed there. I was good. I put in a hotel and ran through my 
the nigga put us on the road on a bullshit ass promo tour and ran through the rest of my budget. You think this bitch had try to say, hey, 50. So you got around you ask his right hand man. Cause I moved both of them with me and, 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 and committed to make sure straight. Just got out the phone with Accept who hell everything and who they over. Solid. I'm supposed to not speak my mind. You got me. I started this barbecue shit. I started this barbecue shit. <laughs> I'm Damn. The so everybody wants a piece of the pie. Louisiana's big enough for everybody, right? But comment below who you rolling with and who's the king of Louisiana. If you got the time, list your top five MCs from Louisiana. Is Louisiana about to take over the rap scene like they did years ago with the Hot Boys and No Limit? Comment below, let me know. This comment section's about to go crazy. And oh, like, share, and subscribe to the best damn channel on YouTube is Rap Fire TV. <laughs> ah.